Top 10 Air Pistols Welcome to our channel once again. Today we are going to look at the top 10 best air pistols in the world. The air pistols have become very common, and a lot of them are used in amusement parks for popping up balloons. Just kidding. People have been often caught to face difficulty in between several choices when it comes to choosing an air pistol. You don't have to walk in a pistol store and get stranded anymore because we are going to help you find which one suits you by considering the following features, range, power, and accuracy. This features differentiate which pistol is the best. They are the key variables that differ from one to the other, apart from the material used to manufacture. This video is for educational purposes only. Click the subscribe button and press the bell icon, or this spider will crawl on your face while you are sleeping. Number 10 is Colt Defender. It's an affordable and reliable type of air pistol. The Colt Defender is a 16-shot BB air pistol with a built-in magazine and sturdy all-metal construction. Fixed front and rear sight provide a more accurate firing, while the spring-powered grip release is bound to last over the years. It's a lightweight model which packs a velocity of 450 feet per second, making it one of the more powerful BB pistols on the market without having to increase the overall size and weight. The Colt Defender stands on its own as a dependable model that will fire every time if taken care of. It has also got the front and rear sights for improved accuracy. Loading a CO2 cartridge into the Defender can start as a bothering task and will take you several tries before you get custom to it. Thank you for staying with us as we took you through the top 10 air pistols. This information we provide is highly reliable and of quality standards. Number 9 is Crossman CCP 8B2 Vigilante. It's built off the CCP 8B2, which already makes itself a favorite air pistol among beginner, intermediate, and hobby owners. Still, the classic style is only a piece of the puzzle as to why it's favorite with a classic revolver. Ten pellets or six BBs are loaded into the interchangeable and removable clips, which easily pops in and out of place for convenient reloading. It comes with a higher powered velocity of 435 feet per second, an adjustable rear sight, and a tactical rail system to add a scope later. The CCP 8B2 serves the single or double shooting action. At 435 feet per second, the Vigilante is one of the most powerful pellet guns you'll find fitting for its revolver build. The Vigilante is equipped for single and double action firing. In only three pounds of pressure, the pulling weight makes it a surprise that Vigilante is capable of its powerful velocity. Number 8 is Beretta Elite 11 BB Pistol. The power of Elite 11 falls mid-range with a maximum velocity of 410 feet per second fueled by a 12-gram CO2 cartridge. This 177 caliber pistol is semi-automatic bears a trigger with double action and single-stage adjustability, and weighs a considerably light 1.5 pounds. It looks exactly how a Beretta should, making it difficult to want to put it to use and not keep it on display. However, it has got a dropout magazine. The replacement of CO2 is tough. The CO2 cartridge gives the user a little trouble during replacement. Number 7 is Umarex Legends M712 Blowback Air Gun. The plastic and metal build of this blowback-enabled air pistol lends to a light frame of 2 pounds. A non-rifled barrel of 5.5 inches sticks from a metal and plastic body, which fires off BBs from a magazine chamber at a velocity of 390 feet per second. It's not powerful compared to other models, but the accuracy is impressive. The loading process is more difficult than how it needs to be, but on the other hand, it's a fine model air pistol that fits well within a hobbyist collection due to its unique design. It is tough to load, as the magazine tends to pop out if not handled with a steady hand. It makes a blowback action using M712 easier with each firing. Number 6 is Crossman's C41 Air Pistol. This is a 2-pound air pistol that looks similar to the weather. The C41 BB air pistol is also semi-automatic, though it fires 4.5mm steel BBs instead of real bullets. It's constructed by mainly metal, including the dropout magazine leading to the loudness of the firearm. A quick-trigger pull-and-use amplify the construction. 
The compartment is hidden, not to ruin the aesthetic of the sleek-looking air pistol. The C41 air pistol is inexpensive, despite being made entirely of metal. It has got a hidden CO2 compartment, which leads to the loudness of the Walter P38 design. It has as well too big, and users with small hands find the grip of C41 to be generally huge and uncomfortable to fire. Number 5 is Beeman P3 Pellet Pistol. It's a smooth-looking air pistol, which can be easily mistaken for the real thing. It looks heavy-duty, but an easy-to-use a model that is accurate with each shot powered by single-stroke pneumatic firing mechanic, you'll only need to cock over once before it's ready to go. The P3 can be dry-fired without concern for damaging the gun. The steel and polymer construction can stand up in various weather conditions and over a long period of use. The Beeman P3 appeals to all kinds of gun levers, and its offering certainly call out to beginners too. It's also got impressive accuracy. The P3 boasts accuracy of 20 inches. That's one of the best on the market and makes it a great target pistol. It is difficult to cock. Generally, cocking is more on the difficult side and requires multiple attempts before getting to the right shot. Number 4 is Gamo P25 Blowback Pellet Pistol. Gamo P25 Blowback is a lightweight model with a sizable velocity of 450 feet per second. This makes it a great option for hunting small game, and its smaller size, 1 to 7 pounds, is easy to carry around and aim. The double magazine holds 16 pellets, while a manual safety system will prevent any unwanted firings while out stalking your small game. It fits comfortably in your hands, providing a steady aim. The blowback created a more authentic fire while automatically cocking for the next shot. The P25 is only capable with standard pellets, as it is somehow limited. Number 3 is Umarex 2254A21 TDP45. Umarex is a small-time player among the manufacturers. Though it may not have a recognizable name, Umarex 2254A21 TDP is a quality model air pistol that stands up to the well-known manufacturers. The maximum velocity of the TDP-45 reaches 410, so you don't expect to do much vermin hunting. The TDP-45 caters to the beginner market and includes a loader which can be used until you are comfortable without it. The included weaver rails allow you to add whatever accessories you view necessary for a full experience. This small pistol may not look like much, but it can be compared to the models from better known manufacturers. Its goodness is that it's got an easy trigger pull. It wants to appeal to an amateur crowd, and the light trigger pull makes this an accessible model. The model also fits comfortably well in your hands because of its smallness and size. It is also average at its best. Number 2 is Daisy 9854154442 Hunting Air Pistol. It has got a smooth barrel of hunting, which makes it a good feel while the semi-automatic firing makes it powerful for target practice. CO2 cartridges power it. The BB repeater fires off at a maximum velocity of 500 feet per second. A BB magazine comes built in it and can hold up to 21 shots, therefore reloading is not necessarily too frequently. The design, therefore, makes changing out the CO2 cartridge more difficult. It is great for the competition. The higher the velocity and frequent firing make the pellet gun great for targeting. The CO2 chambers are not obvious and require a little work to get to, which may be a problem if you continuously use the pistol for swapping out the cartridges. Number 1 is Winchester Model 11K CO2 Pistol. It is the prolific gun manufacturer that made firearms its business since 1866. This model isn't nearly as powerful as its real counterparts, was built with the same quality craftsmanship. A 12-gram CO2 cartridge powers the model. The Model 11K is a semi-automatic BB gun, capable of a mid-range velocity of at least 410 feet per second. It's also a light trigger, which requires only 4 pounds of pressure to engage. The Model 11K fires accurately, but does require steel BBs. Using plastic pellets may cause damage to the unit. The model has two CO2 cartridges and 750 Winchester BBs to allow for intermediate use upon arrival. It also has got included accessories as it comes with everything you need to use right out of the box. Furthermore, the model has got a light trigger. At only 4 pounds, the trigger is easy to pull, making it easy to fire off shots. 
Thanks for watching the video. Comment down below which air pistol do you like the most? And let us know.